Okay, gentlemen, both receive your instructions in your dressing room. Okay, right here is good, aim the right to low. Right here is good, aim the right to low. I want a good, clean fight. Obey my commands at all times, above all, protect yourselves at all times. Let's go. Okay. Or will Mikey become a three division world champion? Wearing the black, wearing the red and gold puncher in Dejan's full hooks. They come on the inside. And the jab, that stunned jab. He's thrown about 10 or 11 jabs, and we haven't even gone through nine. And a straight left that misses, but Garcia parting in, coming in. Counter puncher when he needs to be. Satijan and a right hook, but the butt air and the reach advantage is clear in Grand Garden. Round one. Nice jab, followed by us with his jab. Basic fundamentals for Oxnard. Mikey using his distance extremely well on his levels as the corner Jose Benavides was instructed to him and now for Katijan, that is the brilliance and the intelligence of Mikey Garcia and now he continues to go after it 60 seconds removed in round two Mikey continues to use his shot and a left hook to the body and Satijan Pounds away at his in order for him to get on the inside, he's got to start jabbing him. The thing, Mikey Garcia doesn't make many mistakes under mid. So, strategically, it would be wise for him to throw. Be happy and content to stay on the outside. And an overhand left that connected, but can be tip of the world. Actually, up around four in the morning. Gaps. And he's not throwing anything. That's not going to serve him stretch of the imagination. A hook that missed. And Garcia with the... He is doing some work and, and really... But teaching him, he's got to find a way to press Mikey. Uh, gets and an uppercut. Oh, it's the teaching. It's hurt. The right hook puts him down. This one is over. Oh, my goodness. Mikey Garcia has become a three-division world. Champion! Now this is actually, we hope that's a teaching and he's being brought in. He is out cold. He is out cold. The jubilation on Mikey Garcia. That is a way to make a statement, but Satijanin is still, he's breathing now, but the doctors are checking on him. Mikey Garcia, oh my goodness. There's a reason why there was so much excitement. There's a reason why there was this, this hope that Mikey would return to the sport of boxing and continue to rise and be the superstar that everyone felt he could be. Well, look at tonight, January 28th, 2017. He was a star. But old man, Mikey Garcia is without question a superstar. And now Deon Satijanin is been he is being administered oxygen by the doctors with the Nevada State Athletic Commission. That was a vicious knockout. 36 and 0, 30 knockouts. Three division world champion. He will join the ranks of Floyd Mayweather, Julio Cesar Chavez, Alexis Arguello, as by putting the WBC lightweight championship around his waist. Commission, commission. Hey, bro, los guantes, los vamos a quedar o ustedes nosotros. That's right. He was asking if they keep the gloves or not. He asked the commission. He asked Mauricio Suleiman, the president of the WBC, and now it's Latijanin. They take off the oxygen mask, and it looks like to be responding well to the ringside positions here. And this is something you do not want to see, but every precaution is being taken care of. And the Nevada State Athletic Commission, one of the best commissions in the world, and now Latijanin will come up and the fans cheer him. He's a warrior, he's a gladiator. And he just got caught in devastating fashion against Mikey Garcia. Now he rises to a stool. That, that's a wonderful sign. And I know that he's probably visibly disappointed. 
Bennett, the director of the Nevada State Athletic Commission.